Hello ladies and gentlemen, it is Hunter and Fireball back for the Season 14 Race 1 Darud Sandstorm first moto. We just saw the heat, uh, and now we're going to go into the first of two six-lap motos. Um, just very quickly to run through the starting order based on the heat results. First place taking pole is, uh, it was Detail, I believe it was. I was about to say Pancake, but no, it was Detail. Uh, then Luke... Then uh, Slaunch, then Pancake, then Fireball, Soul Reaper in sick for very good uh, heat result. Uh, Vulcan, I believe that is, in seventh. Uh, Armada in eighth. Uh, ninth is Arpex. Uh, tenth is Hunter. Eleventh is Roman. Twelfth is Nuked. Sully in 13th, and then rounding out the back of the pack in 14th is Venom, new racer, first ever race in the HRL. So a slight correction there, it was actually Venom ahead of Sully, so uh, Venom in his first race does not qualify in last place. Uh, that is what Fireball's here for. As the green light goes out, Sol might have slightly jumped the start there, but uh, I forgot about on that, that one. Nah, yeah, it's, it's the first race this season. It, it, no penalty, no penalty. All looking very tight and close uh, off of this first lap. Remember, only six laps because of how long this track is. Oh, things getting very interesting. Somebody spun out slightly at the back there. That was kind of... Oh! oh is that Soul? Crash. That was Vulcan. Oh, is it Vulcan? Oh, that Vulcan is Vulcan gets rough. whipped around again by the rumble. He's having, He's having an unlucky rumble luck. Yeah, he is. Side by side here between Nuked and Venom. Oh, Venom spins out. We've seen all sorts of battles uh, all across the track right now, but we will catch up to the lead to see how they are doing. Coming into the, the big old canyon jump, it is still Detail, Luke, Pancake, Slaunch, and Fireball rounding out the top five. With Soul in Soul. sixth. Hunter in Opics eighth, and trying to get... Hunter. Trying to get Arpix for 7th. Uh, one thing we didn't talk about in the heats is this corner here. There's actually a, an outside and an inside line. And you'll probably see a lot oh. of people taking the outside uh, using the wall to gain speed. Uh, and on some occasions, it is an opportunity to, to gain some speed and pass people uh, who stick to the inside. It's definitely a tricky It's definitely a tricky move. So if, if someone experienced is taking the inside of the corner and someone t is on the outside, you can definitely come up the track and cut them off. Um... It's not the best move, but um, if, if you get that outside run, I, I was telling people, uh, I, I think it was the quicker line, and I think I think you'll see some moves happen in the race. That was a great move there. Battle for is, the lead. Front three is starting to get away from the rest of the pack slightly. Detail defending against, is that Pancake it looks like? Yeah, Pancake's hungry for Luke, the lead already. Luke just trying to sniff out any opportunity he can to maybe get a double pass on both of them if they get a little bit too hot battling with each other. So we go on to lap two. Let's just actually look, just to clarify the gap here, the top three. Ah, well, the gap to fourth isn't crazy oh, big. Fireball a gets a little action. bit too wheel. That corner there is also a very tricky one. If you Honor go into out. it, if you go into it the wrong angle, you could, yeah, you get two wheel as uh, Fireball did, or you could spin out. Um, definitely going to see, see some flip action. There. Yeah, might see some flip action. I really Man, do I like put the. A hole in the cave. I really do like what uh, what was done with both caves. Actually, of course, the original version of this track only had that one cave section, and then it was expanded uh, to accommodate for the second cave in the second half of the track. The uh, front three. Still going strong here. Gap's kind of staying the same. Soul's kind of catching... Oh, what a move there for fourth place. Uh, Soul is, catch, is catching up to this uh, this fourth, fifth place battle here. Then you got Roman and Opix right behind and a little battle themselves. Kind of kind of little two-way two, two -way packs going on. Hunter, Hunter in the back with, with Ice Cream. I'm going to keep calling him Ice Cream. He's never going to be nuked. And then Soul, Vulcan Heaven. Uh... I'm sorry, I was just going to say, actually, it's kind of a quick opportunity. 
to sort of profile a lot of these guys, because anyone that is, of course, a regular viewer on this channel will probably recognize a lot of the names uh, in here. Sol, one of the most well-known names, a hugely experienced racer. He's been racing since before even I knew him, back in the days of Halo 3. Um, Sol has got a little bit of skill. The biggest problem with Sol is his lack of consistency. You never know what you're going to get with Sol. Uh, but he seems to be delivering right now. He started in sixth, has maintained sixth, and is hey, looking pretty right. comfortable. Looking pretty he's, comfortable. In he's that keeping up with the Slaunch and Fireball right now. Who both have, who, who both haven't lost any time. Not too much time, actually. Let's get another look at that gap from the top three to four and five. Eh, they, they might be pulling away a little bit, but Soul, Soul's honestly keeping up right there, and then. Hunter and Roman little getting behind him. Little, uh, little tough on each other there. Hunter is trying to force his way past Roman Ooh. here. He's going to have the inside line here going into the first cave. He's Roman can't it. cut back. And that is a position gained. Quickly That's go true. back to the lead battle. It's a big thing, of course, with this track. And in a way, I guess it's, it's, a, it's a positive for the racing and negative for, uh, for viewing it. Extremely difficult to keep track of everybody on uh oh yeah on this track it's massive looks like there's a little bit of a gap grown with luke i'm not sure if luke made a slight mistake but he has dropped back and fireball arguably catching back up soul spins out oh but no hunter goes well wide and has to oh. cut the corner to avoid crashing into is that Opix or vulcan yeah and actually that kind of Opix. benefits hunter a little bit oh, and gets a bit so. lucky he, uh, Hunter gets a little bit lucky because he has got back in front of Roman uh, off of taking that little uh, shortcut. So I guess that's a that's an example of the inside on that corner working. Yeah, the inside the inside definitely has its perks. I, I just think if if the outside gets ran perfectly clean, it's definitely quicker. It's just it's a little riskier to run. It looks like gaps are starting to appear. It looks like Sol has finally dropped back slightly. Although, actually, he's in a bit of a battle for sick right now. Who is that? That Optics? is Optics. That is Optics. Hunter and Roman still close. So there's a lot of close battles all over the track right now. Uh, we've just passed, I believe, the halfway mark. Uh, I believe we're just going on the... Yeah, we're just going on the lap three now. Oh, sorry, we just completed lap three going on to Just lap completed four. lap three, yeah. Battle for the lead still. Still detail Pancake Pancake. Is... Oh! Detail gets, detail gets a little bit two-wheel action. Doesn't flip out, but it was close. And Pancake takes the lead. Pancake, hugely experienced and skilled driver, pretty much on any Halo. Um, the old Halo 4 days on the 360... MCC, Halo 5, not done that much Halo 5 racing, I don't think. He's really picked it up in more recent times. Yes, yeah, definitely he's, recently. He's still picked it up and just gone with it. It's just, that might I mean, be all he needed. I don't, I don't know if Detail can... Does he have enough speed to, to get by him again? It might just come down to a simple mistake. That is, is the only way maybe now Detail can catch him. Detail's back ripping that. Doesn't rip the cushion, just rips outside. We go into the second game. I'm going to take a slightly uh, wider angle, just so you can see just how big, from the outside of the cave, you can see just how big this cave is. <laughs> and it's just like, oh, hello, what we got going on here? We got a, oh. a three-way battle in the mid-pack between uh, Hunter, Roman, and Strafe, I think that is, with okay. Nuked not far behind him. This is also a thing, actually, I might just bring up in terms of uh, racing. Everybody still calls uh, Vulcan Vulcan. Uh, the jumpers oh, have pretty much gotten yeah. used to calling him Strafe since his uh, game attack changed several years ago now. But everyone still calls him Vulcan. Which is quite funny. Funny enough, if you actually look back, another pack is right behind them in a three-way battle. And the, it's the three stooges. The red, the red, and the red. Look at them. <laughs> Soli, Armada, and Venom, who's, I think, leading the three. Is he not? That, I think that is. I'm. I am almost confident that is Venom leading the three right now, coming into what lap lap Not four my, lap five. We just we, uh, yeah, just completed lap four. So we've got two laps left. Two laps left. 
I get back on this lead battle. The lead battle here, looking that looks like Luke and Fireball. So this is the lead battle, all spaced out, just a little bit, enough spaced out enough that nobody can really go for a pass right now unless someone crashes out or makes a mistake. But the top four is way ahead now of uh, the best of the rest, which is Slaunch in fifth. Um, Soul and Optics. Soul still maintaining that sixth position. I don't want to big it up too much, like it's a shock that Soul is in this position. But um, anyone, you know, link in the description. No, he's kept said the to speed. Luke's, link in the description to Luke's channel. You can see all the races from the regular season 14. Well, from the races before it. Uh, we went into this format. Soul yeah. had a pretty had a pretty rough time on the uh, the go karts. Picked it up in the TRS. Uh, but Sol is having a fantastic first race here He's in the uh, season in, too. in the season 14 cup. Another person actually who's having a really good bounce back is Slaunch. Slaunch has had a really rough go of it recently. Um, a little bit of it bad luck, a little bit of it sort of internet problems, connection issues. Um, sort of getting caught up in wrecks as well. Slaunch got new internet going into this race, and has had a really clean race. Top five is really sort of back towards the areas that uh, Slaunch is used to being in, battling at the front. As we go, as the leaders go on to the last lap. Battle for second. Luke has absolutely closed the gap here on Detail. Detail could be Pulled in danger of fireball. losing his second place. You know, he was in the lead, made a mistake, that cost him the lead. Now he's looking to hold on to second ahead of Luke. Fireball looks clean. like he's too far back. Look at this gap from 4th to 5th. Uh, that is a big gap. Soul's still right there on Slaunch trying to make something happen. Where are we going? <laughs> Slightly I think we were just at the same come thing. Out of the, come out of the cave. Uh, Pancake still maintaining it. The Luke is all over the back of detail right now. What's Go he going to do? Up the hill. For the big jump opportunity actually to really screw somebody over or screw yourself over with this jump if you're right behind somebody you could get really bad luck with the halo 5 goose and just flip off of hitting the back oh, of yeah. somebody's goose in midair luke opts not to go for the outside line decides to cut back inside he could have maybe gained some speed but luke is such a seasoned and experienced driver and successful the most successful driver in yeah. the hrl on halo 5. The detail's pretty darn successful too. I think detail might have gained like a goose coming out of that. Can he keep We're it? Stick though? with this for the rest of the way, and then we'll catch back up to see if anything else happens uh, on the last lap. It looks like it's pancakes now. All he's got to do is make this last banked turn, hit it clean, and he should be golden. Fireball goes a little deep, uh, probably because he's got nothing to lose there, but uh, obviously doesn't work out. Pancake. Through the second last corner clean, takes the last corner a little wide. Detail holds off Luke nicely. Pancake takes the win. Detail second, Luke third. Fireball, the host or the creator of this track, comes home in fourth. And it looks like it is Slaunch that holds on to the top five. Still a fantastic result for Soul in sixth. Apex seventh, a pretty clean race. Hunter in eighth. Roman in ninth. Uh, oh, Noob looks with like the pass. Noobs made top 10 strafe that's kind of unfortunate considering where strafe started on in the race we're gonna he have had to that see bad what happened to vulcan at the end of the race he had that bad uh start on the first lap uh vulcan 11th uh is that who's this is this venom in 12th i think I'm this is you, venom venom finishes in 12th in his first race ahead of uh sully and then armada armada unfortunately coming in last and he started eighth so Armada was the big uh, loser in the uh, positions gained and lost in that race. There is the uh, results there again on the screen, as I just said. Fantastic result for Pancake. Another win. Uh, and he was the big gainer because he started fourth. So he gained the most positions going from fourth to first. Uh, and then the rest of the results you can see there. There's a couple of other drivers that gained two positions off of their uh, starting grid order. But yeah, that is the results for Moto 1. But we have 
Moto2 now. 